Hey, Jacoby is lost here, and this is Grand Theft Auto Online on the PlayStation 4, and uh, it's been a little while since I've played some GTA, and uh, it's also been a little while since I've been uploading consistently, but I was having trouble sleeping, and I thought, you know what? I think I'm going to play some GTA. Yeah, so I woke up like 2 o'clock in the morning, something like that, and you know, I thought, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play some GTA, then I thought, you know what? I'm gonna record a video. The reason why is because uh, after I woke up, I was uh, laying there in bed and I was thinking, man, I kind of want to play some Tomb Raider. Because uh, before I was gonna play GTA, I kind of wanted to play Tomb Raider, the um, remake, uh, the uh, the reboot, I guess you could would call it. I think that's what it is. Not a remake, it's a reboot. But anyway, so I thought, you know, I was thinking about that game, and then I remembered, oh right, I don't have that game on Xbox. <clears throat> Excuse me, I. Uh, well, I mean, I, ha I own that game, but a while back, I actually, uh, and this is also why I wanted to make a video, because I thought, hey, this is an interesting topic to talk about, I guess. Maybe, maybe not, but anyway, so I thought, uh, well, no, no, I didn't think, but, um, <laughs> excuse me, my head's kind of all over the place, but, um, so I, I own it on the Xbox 360, I bought it a while back, and, you know, I didn't play that game for a very long time, I owned it and didn't play it for a very long time, but anyway, so I loaned it to a friend of a friend I guess you could say because like like I know the person but I you know I wouldn't say we're best friends or anything like that but I do know them uh, and they because they came over and they uh, recently had bought an Xbox 360 for their uh, for their kids and they wanted a game to because uh, they didn't really have any games and um, he was telling me about his his daughter his young daughter that he has and he said you know that she wanted a game to play, and I was like, um, Tomb Raider. Tomb Raider seems like a really good game, uh, because, um, the reason why is, you know, Laura Croft, Laura Croft, excuse me, not Laura, I didn't mean to say it like that. It's my accent! I apologize! But anyway, uh, she's a very good, um, female character to look up to, in a way, you know, like, she, uh, does great things, and, you know, kind of, in a way, shows, uh, you know, someone who's never uh who doesn't know who Lara Croft is then you know they'll be like oh this character is really cool she's very strong willed uh female character and uh she is and so I thought this is great this is a great game to play uh for like a for a uh for, for his daughter because you know she's a strong character and I thought it'd be cool for her to be able to see a female character who's strong like that but anyway and it also made me think about um, my friend uh, a while back. We, uh, me and my friend, we were talking about Tomb Raider and the reboot. And this is a long time ago now, before it was out. And we were both kind of going back and forth about whether or not it would be good. And then uh, my friend was saying that she uh, didn't like the idea of a reboot that much. And that she liked the Lara Croft from before, you know, the original series before the reboot. And I was saying that, you know, I think it's cool that they're refreshing the character and uh, kind of, you know, putting their own new spin on it. And uh, so, oh, and the reason why I bring that up is because she told me that uh, the reason why she enjoyed Tomb Raider and the Lara Croft character so much is because that when she was younger, she would play that game with her bigger sister and uh, they would take turns playing the game and like figuring out the puzzles together. And I thought, that's really cool. That's awesome. Because in a Silent Hill video that I made a while back, uh, I actually talk about, uh, the name of that is Silent Hill 2 Storytime. Uh, and in, in that video, I talk about how I had experienced Silent Hill 2 with some of my cousins. And they had watched me play the game and they helped me figure out some of the puzzles. And they were both entertained by just watching the game as much as I was playing the game. And so... It's pretty cool that, you know, games can bring people together like that. But um, the reason why I bring up the whole loading the game out is because the person hasn't brought the game back. And I thought, at first I was kind of upset, you know, oh, great, I'm not going to get my game back. But then I thought, you know what? It's such a good game that it's kind of cool to think about, like, passing on this game experience that could in some, in in some way impact the person who plays it. And I thought, that's pretty cool. Maybe she'll really like Lara Croft, you know. I don't know his daughter, so hopefully she enjoys the game. 
Obviously, she probably is if he hasn't returned the game, right? But anyway, yeah, that's uh. So I just wanted to share that little story there because at first I was a little upset, like I said, and then I thought, no, I hope she enjoys it. I hope she has a good time, and I hope she likes the character. So, yeah. Anyway, I hope you're having a good day or night, depending on when you watch this. And as always, thanks for watching.